Ladies and gentlemen, my name is Rajesh Joshi. I represent Flowline Healthcare and I am here to take you through the Dragonfly, the only servo oscillator in the world. When I say the only servo oscillator in the world, there are a couple of things that imply. One, it is a true high frequency oscillator and not a hybrid machine. Two, it is servo controlled, which means that irrespective of the parameters that you change, the mean airway pressure will remain the same that you had set. My friends, all of you obviously know the importance of this particular function since the mean airway pressure is the most important parameter. How does it work? Let us take a look. As you see here, the Dragonfly has a large TFT display with flow versus time, pressure versus time, classical loops and curves. It also displays the bias flow that the machine uses, the DCO2, the actual tidal volume that is delivered, the actual mean airway pressure that is delivered. You can also set parameters you can also help this particular display to see what parameters have you set. How do you set these parameters? This is with the help of this touchpad where this is with the help of the touchpad. So for example, suppose I want to change the mean airway pressure. All I do is press this button here, the LED light glows and the mean airway pressure value has started to flicker. I use these up and down keys. So the up key is to increase, the down key is to decrease and I have lowered the mean airway pressure to 10 and I press enter. When I press enter, the computer memorizes this value for further references. For the demonstration's sake, the frequency, in, uh, uh, the frequency here is 15, the inspiration time is 33 or 1 is to 2, the delta P is set at 25. We have selected the FiO2 percentage at 70. We have ensured that the inspiratory and the expiratory limb are properly connected to a test lung, a neonatal test lung here. We are ready to go. Now once I have pressed start here, what you will see as a display is that the machine is continuously saying wait adjusting map. So the machine now automatically calculates what is the bias flow required to maintain a map of 10 centimeter water column plus minus 1. As you can see here. The mean airway pressure that is delivered actually to the patient is 11 centimeter water column. Since the formula is P max plus P minimum divided by 2, the value would be somewhere around 10.5 or 10.6 and hence it is rounded off to the nearest number. Now to demonstrate the servo mechanism part of the machine, what we are going to do is we will make a series of online changes to the parameters other than the mean airway pressure. So, let us start with frequency. The frequency was set at 15 hertz, which is 900 breaths per minute. We will take the frequency down to say 12. I pressed enter. The loops and curves have changed with lower number of breaths per minute. There is a change in the volume, there is a change in the way the machine behaves. However, the mean airway pressure which is actually delivered has remained same. The machine has corrected the flow and the mean airway pressure automatically to remain at the value that you had initially set. Let us try another scenario. 
Suppose I change the delta P. The delta P was at 25. I want the delta P to be at 28. I increased it. I pressed enter. The power has increased. However, as you can see here, the mean airway pressure has remained the same. With these things in mind, you can now realize that the servo mechanism actually helps the clinician and the user to ensure that they do not have to go through tedious calculations, especially at times when the doctor or the intensivist is not available. All you can do is change the parameter as suggested by the clinician and the mean airway pressure will get automatically adjusted. Certain features of the product. You don't have to invest now in training. Training can be done online here about what the machine is all about. With the press of the F1 key, one can access either the manual, the clinical data or the HFOV key factors. You can also freeze these loops and curves for analysis and training. The machine, my friends, is modular in nature, which ensures very low down, down times, which also ensures faster serviceability and low costs of ownership. You do not have to calibrate the piston every time or which is popularly known as centering the piston every time because it is auto adjusted. You can use stock standard breathing circuits which we currently get from intersurgical. These should be smooth bore cir circuits specially made for HFOV and intersurgical now has started designing special circuits only for the dragonfly. This my friends is the HFOV, the dragonfly, the world's only true servo controlled high frequency oscillatory ventilator that can be used to treat patients from 600 grams to 20 kilos. A couple of our doctors, however, have also successfully treated patients weighing as low as 475 grams and as high as 26 kilos. The machine is sturdy, has proved its worth, is CE and ISO 134855 certified, has passed every possible test that you could put the machine through. I look forward to receiving your inquiries, queries, doubts and suggestions and feedback. This is Rajesh Joshi. Thank you very much for your patient listening. Thank you.